recently I got many questions, you know, regarding hey I wanna make an intro and you know I don't wanna waste a lot of time making it. So which is the best uh, you know we uh, intro making software. Directly though After Effects. After Effects? No, something easy, like you know, just very very simple. Which one should I go for? Again I'll let me think, let me think. Is it something? So I just told him uh, go to any movie editing software and take a template and make an intro, which is the easiest thing you can do. But you all know that's shabby. You know, shabby? Then uh, you should probably go for a very, very easy intro making software, which is it. And then I thought, and then I thought. And after a long time, I gave him a very good answer Core Motion Studio. So, what Core Motion Studio allows you to do is uh, very, very simple actually. You get a lot of templates and more things like that, and it's pretty simple. So, it's not like you know, you are uh, making anything, it's it's just done and uh, but there are many many limitations no keyframes and like for example this is my text right here and I wanted to zoom in but uh, at the third second like it's a four second intro and I wanted to zoom in one second which is not possible with Core Motion Studio because the keyframe you make will just change the color or I think the texture or something like that but not the position or you know the attributes you are doing so if you want to zoom in you can't do that so some, there are some limitations obviously so that's not good otherwise Core Motion Studio is in a very very good application or a uh, you know, thing to do if you have seen my intros they're all made by Core Motion Studio because I'm just learning after the fact I'm not telling anyone hey make a video for me you know make an intro for me I want to make it myself and it should be you know, pleasing that I like it so I'm, I'm just trying my best I've learned a lot a lot in After Effects but talking about you know perfection is not there so I'm just waiting until I get the best result and then I'll use it in my video so there's no rush for temporary I'm using Core Motion Studio which is again a really really nice uh, software for making intros so if you're looking for for Core Motion Studio it's a very very nice software yeah you get full 1080p uh, HD playback of your intros and uh, you can make your own backgrounds you can make gradients and it's 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 fun it's like you learn some things you get more ideas for uh, Adobe After Effects and you can do a lot of things with it and it's pretty simple actually and uh, a lot of templates are there you get you know really optical flares you get lighting you get you know you know some animation you get some objects you can play with objects you can you know, create something uh, it's, it's, it's pretty simple I'm not making a video you know showing you guys hey how did how is it but I'm just uh, you know telling you you can do a lot of things with it so guys uh, this was Mr. Tech Agent and uh, the links are in the description if you want to download or to buy the software download, download the, the download edition is there you can get it for a cheaper price I think so and it's worth the money so if you are looking forward for something like that the Core Motion Studio is the thing for you and uh, I'll, I'll try my best to you know start off with some screencast right. hey guys let's jump over to the computer and take a look at Core Motion Studio hey guys this is Core Motion Studio so this is a parody of uh, 28th Century Fox if you can see that this is for Universal Studios and these are some objects which you can play with let's go to some text effects and uh, as I promised you guys there are many many uh, you know, transitions in built so let's take a look as you can see a lot of them are right here and uh, this one is looking pretty cool actually is it? I don't know it's all up to you all guys explosion very good huh. this is lame yeah, this looks uh, lame again so it, it's all up to you it's how you make it yeah, I, would, uh, I, would, I, as I recommend you all guys you are probably very good with Adobe After Effects but you know you need something simple so in global effects you get some lighting so 
lighting where is it yeah uh, glow so glow is actually a very very good uh, you know background you can create it looks pretty neat personally my favorite is this one yeah. it's some blue color thing coming out you can change the color obviously it's pretty nice and uh, looks pretty good so uh, you, you guys would be thinking why I'm not using a, a screen recorder uh, because I don't like that the quality is better better off right now so guys that's kind of it yeah, you get some object effects if you have some object so you can do something like that text effects as I showed you and at the end of the video I'll, um, I'll be uploading some of the uh, intros I made using uh, this software which is Coral Motion Studio so guys uh, thank you for watching